Hey guys, today we'll be doing a video on the potential two new DLC packs that'll be in LEGO Star Wars The Skywalker Saga, and this is a video game and bonus one. This will be covering ones that I did not do in my other DLC pack video, be sure to check them out. And these are kind of ones that are either like LEGO based, or they're like ones that don't really fit into the rest of the game, or any other ones. The first potential characters in the bonus DLC pack is the Freemaker, some characters from the Freemaker Adventures. Um, these got their own character pack in the Force Awakens game, I can't imagine them having another one. However, I would love to see the mock droid um, come into Lego game form. Another Lego made one is Jack 14. I can't imagine there being any other characters from the Yoda Chronicles. However, I think Jack 14 would be a really cool character to have in-game. The next characters that will be in the bonus DLC pack for predictions is the J.J. Abrams and Kathleen Kennedy who were in the Force Awakens game. And I think that they'll be in-game. Um, some other directors or behind-the-scenes people that I'd love to see would be George Lucas. I feel like they'd kind of have to add him in. And then Dave Filoni, who is definitely kind of in lots of Star Wars news right now, as well as perhaps John Favreau, who is the creator of The Mandalorian. Some more cool characters that I would like to see in the Skywalker Saga would be perhaps some characters from the canon comics, like a Dr. Aphra, and then perhaps a Triple Zero in BT-1, and I think that lots of fans would love to play with them in Lego form. Those are my predictions for a potential bonus pack. Remember, there could also be a level, those are just the characters. And I can imagine a level being pretty similar to the Lego City one from the complete the next saga. next idea for a v potential DLC pack is one with Jedi Fallen Order and Battlefront 2. The reason I put these two together is that we've already had an Inferno Squad Battle Pack. And I can't really see any other important Battlefront 2 characters making it in-game. So I'd perhaps um, add in some of these Battlefront 2 characters in with the Jedi Fallen Order characters we have not seen any official minifigures, and it would be cool to unlock some vehicles such as the Stinger Mantis. Some Jedi Fallen Order characters that I would love to see played in um, Lego game form, and that would be like Second Sister, perhaps the Purge Troopers, and Knight Sister Marin. I think they'd have some pretty cool abilities, and that that would be a really cool character pack. And then of course from Battlefront 2, there are some amazing Inferno Squad minifigures. The only problem with this video game character pack is that I can't imagine them trying to recreate any of the levels as that would kind of be kind of just adding another video game to theirs. Um, I don't think that would really do well and I can't really imagine them with Battlefront 2 doing like a first person shooter thing. So I would perhaps say just stick to a character pack and perhaps some vehicles. Um, however that is my predictions for these two potential DLC packs for LEGO Star Wars The Skull Saga. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Please remember to like and subscribe. That'll be all folks. Goodbye.